Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make the cursor or the pointer appear and disappear from your metric remote. And my TV does not come with the metric remote. Yeah, I bought that from Amazon. My TV comes with only the uh, regular one like this. So I'm not happy with that. So I went ahead and bought this from Amazon. This metric remote has a scroll wheel right here. Let's focus it. And a circle here is the button you can press. Outside here, the scroll wheel. This is a scroll wheel and scroll up and down. So when I first install it and pair it, I don't see any cursor. What's, what's the point? I'm getting the metric remote. So what I did is try to do a research and how I figured out that to bring the cursor out. It's, all you see is, is you see this grow wheel here. All you do is move the wheel up and down. And here you go. You see the cursor. And now you can move it around and point to the different place you want. And when you want to select, all you do is push down, press down the uh, the wheel. So now the this cursor appear. How do you make it disappear? So let me show you how to make this cursor disappear. See the circle I saw earlier before? Right here. All you have to do is push the circle, press the circle down. And now the cursor disappear. To bring it back up, you either use the scroll wheel or now they upgraded the program. And what you do is hit the home button right here. Push down the home button. The bad thing about using a home button because now the screen changes. So I prefer to use the, the scroll wheel here to make the cursor appear or disappear. So again, to show you to make the cursor appear and disappear, you use a scroll wheel, move it up and down. You see, you see it's the cursor here. And instead of hitting the home button, which will make it change the screen and make it disappear, all you do is push down the uh, circle outside the wheel. You see that? The cursor disappear right away. Alright, that's how you make the cursor appear and disappear. Thanks for watching.